The Benton boys basketball team sits at 7-2 and, and enjoying about a 10-day layoff between games for the holidays. During this hot start for the Cardinals, one Benton senior putting up a lot of points and breaking his own dad's scoring mark. KKG's Jackie Elson with more. Basketball is Benton senior Alan Coy's lifeblood. I just love playing. Like, on my free time, I just go shoot at Genesis before every game. His grandfather, dad, and a few aunts and uncles have played, so it only makes sense for Alan to follow suit. Growing up, I wanted to be just like my dad and Uncle Johnny, so that really motivated me. Alan's dad says his family has such a strong relationship with basketball and that Alan's work ethic speaks for itself. With Alan, I know there's no doubt in my mind he's going to he's gonna go out there and try his best. He's a hard worker. In fact, Alan holds some bragging rights over dad. He beat his dad's scoring record at Benton with 38 points in a win over Class 6A Truman of Kansas City. I always grew up wanting to be just like him, and it means a lot just to beat his record and just succeed. Even deeper in the family line, his uncle has the school record, scoring 46 points in the last game of his senior year, and his aunt played at Northwest Missouri State and reached more than 1,200 points in her college career. I for sure want to play at the next level, and I want to have my kids play and just keep it going as a tradition in the family. And dad knows just how hard he works, but also just loves supporting Alan's basketball career and watching him go after his dream. I mean, we're just really proud of Alan, you know. Um, he, he's a good kid. He really works hard. For the rest of Allen's senior season, one of his goals is for the team to make it to state. Yeah, my main goal is to make it really far into March and hopefully make it to the uh, state. That'd be really cool. In St. Joseph, Jackie Elson, KQ2 Sports. Benton's next game's coming on Wednesday in the 12 courts of Christmas at High V Arena down in Kansas City against Holland Hall. Then the Cardinals off until January 6th when they start MEC play with St. Pius at home.